There's a lot of really, really great big picture things that the ICPA is doing and it's going to change the world. Well, there's so much that we do in school and we learn so much. We're spending all this time learning our core concerns and core competencies, but then there's so much you can learn when you get outside of school. And going through the series, I was astounded with how much I learned and how much more education I got and how much more confidence I got in understanding chiropractic and being able to relate it to my practice members and help our future. So my class is family nutrition, epigenetics, and parental nutrition through the perinatal period. Big name, but the goal of the class is really to understand epigenetics and how environmental factors actually play a role in changing how our kids' health is. So we talk about a lot about preconception, talk about the nutrition and how baby develops and how we can change the health status of baby, therefore changing the health status of our future through working on mom and dad's health. There's a lot of confusion when it comes to nutrition and how they should be feeding their kids and what they should be, what filter they should be looking through when they're coming up with nutrition for their children. Uh, this class goes over a lot of that to help understand any kind of concerns that parents might have with nutrition as to when to start foods or the best foods for kids at different times as well as in pregnancy. It amazed me meeting all of the different doctors going through the classes. Um, it is just amazing how much education all of these different individuals come from, the different scopes that they come from and the experiences they have. They're experts in their fields. They're, they're doing this stuff all day every day and to get that knowledge in, in 14 or 15 instructors, it's just incredible. Um, I think any DC would just, your practice is going to do so much better because you just have a deeper understanding, a better understanding of chiropractic. I think seeing seeing that we can change the future, seeing that you know through through personal health challenges, you know mine being cancer, um, but coming through that using nutrition and using chiropractic and understanding what vitalism and salutogenesis actually mean, and just not worrying about the disease, but worrying about really where is your state of health, where are you thriving, and where do you want to thrive? It completely takes you out of the normal disease model but it takes you into this huge picture of what's possible and that is the driving force to my practice every day.